Well, welcome you guys um, to the Elevation Call, our December 19th version. We are so appreciate you guys being on tonight. We missed you guys last week very much. And um, so I feel like I had a little bit of withdrawals uh, from you guys. And, and so tonight we're excited. This is a really special call tonight because uh, really all of us are joined together by the Zalise platform or the product line. And tonight we really kind of want to hear from you guys. Everyone's been with this company a different time period. So we have a couple of brand new ambassadors on the call. And then we also have some people who are more seasoned, but I'm going to have Hal start us off with just recognition of our top 25 enrollers and uh, retailers. Okay. So just to let everyone know, remind you that um, a, a very significant part of what we do uh, with Zalise, with our individual businesses and together uh, is to introduce Zalise, the products. Um, we educate people on the endocannabinoid system. We, we really try to help people understand why um, taking back their health um, is so important. And then what we have to offer uh, with the lease um, in, in our products. And so when people do that, we have two options. One is to sell products retail to them, but most of the time people choose a better price if they can, and we offer that to them. And when they do that, then they enroll into the Zalise family uh, from wholesale to a, to a builder position, whether it be bronze, silver, or gold. And they, and they get a lot of things with that, um, not just better price, but Zalise recognizes uh, people already you know, building teams in Zalise. They recognize them weekly. We re try to recognize them weekly, people on our team. And so Zalise has what they call leaderboards for retail purchases, retail sales, and then new enrollments uh, for the month. But we keep up with it weekly. So I'm just telling you, that's what we're talking about for those. And I know we do have a few people that are new. And we actually on our team, that's how and Lisa's team unlimited, uh, have uh, seven, is that right? Five. Two, oh, yeah. five. Well, okay, five. five. Yeah. And then, okay, we have five this week or at, through this point this month on the leaderboard. So uh, in the top 25 at number 23 out of Indiana is Susan Everett. Let's give her the least wave. Okay. She, she should be on later. Uh, and then at number 15 out of the Houston, uh, Texas area, Dr. Thelma Champion. Woo. Nice job. Congratulations, Thelma. Thelma. And then at number 10, a uh, new ambassador, fairly new, uh, on Julia Baker's team, Delaney uh, Baker uh, out of Indiana, right? Yep. At number 10. And then at number four, we've already mentioned her in our pre meeting here or the early gathering, uh, Lisa Hall out of Arizona and parts unknown everywhere, all over the world, Dr. Hall. And then at number two is Lisa uh, and Hal, but mostly Lisa um, at number two in, uh, in Zalise. And that came uh, for us from an event we did last weekend, yeah, didn't it? Absolutely. So anyway, that's it on the new enrollments and then also retail top 25. And this is a regular, uh, Dr. Susan and Brian Welch uh, out of Florida are at number seven in the retail uh, with her practice there, Wright Parkway Dental. So anyway, congratulations to all of you. Keep it going. We'd love to see our team, people on our team, on all the, the international board of Zalise uh, recognition. And, and uh, I think probably, what, next week will be the end of the month. Yeah. And so Stephen will probably recognize the whole month. Yeah, I don't know. So probably so. so. Anyway. And we have a few new ambassadors. We were actually talking to uh, one of our new ambassadors today. So Lisa Hall, do you want to introduce your new ambassador? Sure. And um, we have to be honest, we're, we're figuring some stuff out with a company. So she has, hasn't actually signed up, but we've been working together for three weeks. She's already talked to seven people. She hasn't signed up yet. So coming out of, of Illinois is Lene Rich. And I want, she's been a nurse for a long, long time. And we're not going to talk about times because then it tells you how old we all are. Uh -huh. But um, I want her to tell you what her job is because she's a really special job and, and it's really an honor to work with her. But she, um, she manages, um, you know, a business 
already. And so she very much understands about how to build a business herself. And she has been phenomenal to um, educate and learn. And she's so excited to get started. And she has huge plans and dreams. And uh, she also has a huge servant heart and wants to help other people. So I'm going to let her introduce you, uh, introduce herself, because she can tell you better about what she does, because I don't want to mess it up. And thank you very much, Lene, for being on the call. And I can't wait to work with you in 2022. Awesome, Lene. Can you unmute? We can't hear you yet. Okay, there we go. There you go. Um, yes, I have been a registered nurse for 39 years. And currently my job is as the professional services director, agency manager for a home health company that deals with special needs children. So we, it's a very high tech kind of uh, medical field. That is fantastic. Well, we are so honored to get to work with you and uh, incorporate this amazing product line and science uh, into what you're doing for your patients. So thank you for being part of this call and for our uh, being part of our team. What part of the Chicago area are you? Where are you in Chicago? I, I, um, yes, I'm north. Lake County is just north of Cook County, which is houses Chicago. So I'm just north and on the lake. Okay. Awesome. All right. Fantastic. Very good. So Lene's already yes, on Glow. Beautiful. Can she tell you what's going on on Glow? No. Tell us, Lene, what's going on on Glow? <laughs> um, on Glow, I've been on it for four days. I took a full packet the first two days and then decided that's quite a bit for me. So I cut it in half. It's already dropping my blood pressure and my pulse, which were out of range. They were horrible. And um, I also feel like I'm losing some weight. That's great. We love hearing that. We love to hear that. <laughs> yeah, we can tell you're glowing. Yes. Fantastic. That's great. Well, I, I also wanted Kristen to introduce her new ambassador, uh, who I look really forward to getting to meet as well. Kristen, do you want to introduce Stacy? See, we see Stacy on there. So Beautiful. far away, Kristen. Well, thank you very much, um, everybody. And uh, thank you, Stacey, for being here tonight. And what a pleasure it is to get to know you and your mission and purpose. Uh, Stacey has been a nurse for 12 years, focusing mostly, mostly with senior um, care and is using her passion and her heart to refocus and her direction um, into servicing children. And I'll let her tell you more about that. but. Um, She's very close to my heart. She reminds me a lot of me and she reminds me a lot of you, Lisa. Um, and we'll get to know more about her. Stacy, introduce yourself. And awesome, Stacy, can you unmute and uh, just uh, introduce yourself? Can you guys hear me? Yes. yes. Hi. Hi. Hey. Uh, my name is Stacy Weaver. Um, I'm a registered nurse. I've been working in long term care mainly. For the last 12 years, um, done a lot of management stuff. Um, I operated and managed nine nursing homes in Ohio, done all the hard, stressful work, and I really just want to do my own thing. Um, I started a wellness clinic um, and the yoga and dance studio. I just got certified as a yoga teacher, and um, it's just a baseline for a lot of um, more social work that I want to do. I'm working with kids in uh, foster care, yeah. child protective services, I'm working with seniors, getting them out and socializing, moving. Um, and I'm really just interested in plant medicine. I've seen uh, devastation from pharmaceuticals, um, diuretics, antipsychotics used with um, Alzheimer's and dementia. Um, I've worked a lot on reducing and getting people off of that. Um, and I just believe that uh, the medicine is in plants and, and I'm so thankful for this opportunity to learn uh, something new. This is my son. He just popped in. <laughs> hey, hey you're, we're trying to start him Aiden. off right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm excited to learn about plant medicine. Fantastic, We're glad to have Stacey. you on the team, Stacy and Kristen. Thank, thank you for your relationship with with Stacy and bringing her on board in the way you do. So, well, thank Nightingale you. Wellness. and congratulations on opening up your own um, Nightingale Wellness, Stacy. Thank, thank you so much, guys. I can't wait to hear more about it, Stacy. So, thank you so much for 
uh, being on the call tonight. It's great to Kristen and Lisa. It's great to get your new people started on Elevation. So we're super, super excited about that. We hope you'll join us every single Sunday to really help you elevate your business and really elevate us as people. And I think this is a good segue into our gratitude Sunday. Gratitude talk, yeah. I was thinking maybe after looking at Facebook that we might start this with having uh, Mercy and Alan Gatabu do their rendition of "It's Like Home for the Holidays." <laughs> now nobody knows what that is unless you're uh, follow them on Facebook. But anyway, that was that was. Oh, stop it! <laughs> <laughs> That was awesome. Stop thank it. you, Mercy. And tell Alan, thank you. I'm grateful that I'm on Facebook nowadays <laughs> and, or met, met, Metro or Meta or whatever it's called and oh, can see, ke keep up with y'all. So, yeah, yeah, tell Alan that we need to have a, a, a little, uh, you know, concert uh, on our elevation call. That was awesome. He's, he's yeah, you he can hear. He's, uh... I'm sure he can. He's always lurking close by. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Good well, to I just see had you guys. to do that. So I, I did want to make a comment, though, before we do. Yes. So um, Lisa and I, over the last month, you know, we don't just, I mean, we, we try to do to build our business, the things uh, that everyone's doing. And um, uh, two times this month, Lisa, but then last weekend, us and the pools, uh, Pat and John Poole had a three-day event um, in Fort Smith, about an hour from us, where we set up for the weekend at a first time ever kind of, um, vendor, what was it? Vendor event. A vendor event. And, um, you know, it wasn't super well attended. It was the first time. It was kind of a hard building to get to. Um, they actually charged to get in. We didn't know they were going to do that. But um, I think the first night we had, you know, which is only about three hours, we had like 15 cards to follow up with. Um, the next day, probably, I don't know, Pat, maybe total over the weekend, probably 40 to 50 cards, something like that of people to follow up with. Um, so I'm just grateful that it, it was actually fun. You know, yeah, it was, it was fun. It was very, you know, it was kind of tiring, but um, for those, what? No, I agree. It was, it was a commitment. It was a commitment. It was up and down the stairs and different things, this building. And um, anyway, that's not something that we've built our business on. But we enjoy doing it and being four years in the business, um, we really have become experts in communicating with people and sharing with them about the endocannabinoid system and just asking people straight up, is there anything about your, your health, your body, your wellness that you for yourself or someone you care about? And you know, it's just a great conversation with people. And, and, and uh, I know we're gonna talk gratitude tonight and I'm glad we did that. Um, it was just Did cool. Yeah. Yeah. And we have people to follow up with now, people looking forward to meeting with us yeah. about that. Um, you know what, uh, what was, I, I want to add to that? We sold um, several 10 day, $50 mm -hmm. uh, start, start packages. And um, I even sold a, a two pack, <laughs> believe it or not, for a two day start for somebody. But we, we've been able to convert um, several people who started on the 10 day uh, to a one month and one of them we were able to enroll. Yeah. So our, this have product appointment tomorrow. About yeah, it, so. This product is really powerful, but what I, I, and I'm really grateful to Pat Poole and John Poole who uh, really did, you know, the hard work of tearing down because we couldn't be there. Um, we, we learned a lot together and hopefully Pat will be able to kind of weigh in on that at some point. But what, one of the things I wanted everybody on this call just to realize, because, you know, once you uh, are new on, you know, you just kind of see a bunch of faces of people you don't know. And there are just a few people on this call that I personally knew when I started four years ago, Angela Noble was one of them. Susan Everett was one of them. Uh, and I think really uh, of everyone on this call, Beth Plumley. Uh, I'm you trying to know think. her a few years ago. No, but, but Beth was personally sponsored oh, okay. as, was my point. And, and what you guys have become is, is really a beautiful tapestry of just positive, I mean, like the, the kind of um, energy that we get from our team on this Sunday call is, is hard to quantify. And so when I really think about what I'm most grateful for, it's this platform that really allows amazing people to be attracted to this plat to our business, to this product line, uh, sometimes, you know, er, people have a different reason for joining this business, 
but at the end of the day, it's this family of amazing souls mm -hmm. that you guys represent uh, that enrich our life. And the only thing I can think of is it's, it's like a beautiful tapestry. And so one of the reasons that I want everyone to stick with this platform, I saw an illustration of someone pushing a huge rock up a mountain. And the challenge is in the beginning when you're just building this tapestry, that it's like somebody is unraveling it on the other side, which is like motherhood in many ways. Um, but when you can overcome the challenge of pushing uphill and you can gain enough voices, enough people on product, enough people that are actually sharing this, that ball starts rolling down the other side and you create the most amazing time and financial freedom uh, that really allows us to go to the Outback Bowl mm -hmm. in, a, in, a, in a week or and so. And to come see some of you along the way. Yeah. So that's really what I'm so grateful for is just that we have pushed through the difficulty uh, of creating this amazing platform to bring uh, people like you guys together. And you're going to you're going to hear some great voices tonight of why people are grateful. And so we're we're going to just say, you know, keep it brief. Um, you know, minute, two minutes, uh, we would love to hear from you guys on the one gift from Zelise that you're most grateful for. So for those of you that are, are new, are fairly new, uh, we usually do some training and maybe just me commenting about stepping out into a, a doing a vendor fair or doing something new for you to build your business is enough training. Uh, but as we wrap up the year, we wanted tonight's call uh, really to be like Lisa said, just you know, keeping it brief. Uh, if you would like to share gratitude, there's some of you that do it every week. I mean, every time we're on the call, you guys are verbalizing your gratitude and, and we very much appreciate that. But anyway, so I just kind of want to open it yeah, up tonight. Just uh, whoever would like to share, we, we'd love to hear from you guys. Me and Brian want to go first. Okay. Let's hear it, girl. So several things real quick. Um, the growth of our practice with the Zelise product um, the number one seller is ice, uh, doing great. And so we're grateful for that growth in the practice, uh, personally and professionally, Brian and I, not everybody knows our struggles, but Zelise has been a catalyst in growing our relationship, working together as a team. And, um, we are taking our Zelise profits and we are taking our children to Gatlinburg at Christmas time. So, uh, we are teaching our, our children and our family that hard work pays off to do extra stuff. So that's kind of what I'm grateful for. And he said he didn't want to say anything. <laughs> hey, Susan, tell us a little bit of uh, your background, just because not everybody, uh, uh, some people are new on this call. So tell oh, us. Uh, what, real quick, I joined Zelise, yeah, in, in September of 2019. Uh, Steve and Jenny Todd, Dr. Todd are my direct upline. And Dr. Todd and I both uh, have uh, the dental background and sleep apnea and uh, dentistry. And it, it came into my practice at a time when I really needed a solid uh, retail product that had some good research behind it. So, um, and then Brian and I have been on a journey of growing our relationship and utilizing uh, Zelise and our dental practice as part of just working as a team. And Brian uh, just said that the, the team and the family of our Zelise support network that we have um, has been incredible in watching us grow and Brian's been doing his briefings in his bare feet. Um, so it, it will, we'll eventually get back to that as we renovate the house and everything, but just, it's been a blessing that the Zelise family has brought to us. Uh, Steve and Jenny Todd are dear, dear friends of ours. So, um, and also you and uh, Hal have been beautiful blessings being able to stop through on the way to South Florida and to come visit. So we're sorry we're gonna miss you this Christmas time, but you'll be back. Hey, we will be back. We will. Thank That's you so sure. much, Susan. Thanks. We love having you and Brian. Seeing, seeing you guys, how y'all are doing, doing life and doing work and, and is uh, from where we were, I, I, over, I guess a year ago, maybe. Um, see how you guys have come along and being a part of that, being for us, being blessed to be a part of much more than Zelise uh, with you guys um, is really what it's ultimately what it's all about. So thank you for that, Susan and quiet, Brian. We'll <laughs> All right. Anybody else? I'll comment. Uh, okay. Yeah, Steve, Jenny, Steve and Todd, and then next uh, thing. Jenny and I, and, and Jenny can also comment about all this, but I, I just think that the opportunity in itself that Stephen has given us is huge. And I know that that some of we reflect sometimes that we've been in this, we've been in this, uh, 
part of the lease for three years almost or three years and you think that's a long time but honestly it's the beginning of the beginning of an industry and we're breaking that ice and because of that I enjoy so much the visionaries like Susan and like the people that I that we actually stumble upon in some way to be able to share this opportunity with them you know there are a few people in the world that have like minds and you got to find them. They're not just sticking out like light bulbs. And you do that by sharing this opportunity with people and just, you know, seeing if that happens. And Susan and Brian are, are a couple of those wonderful people that had had that light bulb. And I think that just being able to develop further relationships with people, people we don't know yet, we haven't met them. Uh, they're not, they're there. And to not say something, I've said this before, but to not say something to somebody about CBD or it just however you want to word it is really doing them an injustice because you don't know who is out there that might gravitate to this in some other, some way that you don't know that that's why they're there. And so I think just the opportunity itself, the purest form of the opportunity is what I'm grateful for. And but I'd like to uh, say what I'm most grateful for, Steve uh, and I coming from a, a dental practice in the private world, the private sector. No one wants you to succeed out there in the private world. All health professionals in our arena wanted to do was take Steve down and made several I'm, attempts. I'm an outlier, just to let you know, I'm an outlier. Yeah, he, <laughs> yeah. he does things different. And, and health professionals, guys in the private world, they don't want you to succeed. They want to take you down. And the, we've been through two very negative experiences with that and, and came through that. But this Elise business, that's not present in this Elise business. People only want to help you succeed. And that is just so refreshing and wonderful compared to the, the, the other side of the, the dental world. It's just so, re, it's wonderful for people to want you to succeed. You know, it's everywhere. Just, there's nothing negative about this business. People are there to help you and they just want you to succeed. And I'm most grateful for that. Awesome, Jenny. Thank you so Thank much you for me. sharing. Angela? Angela. Well, as I look you. as I look at this uh, screen, and you called it a tapestry earlier, and uh, my gratefulness first starts with you, Lisa, because we've known each other a long time, and she drug me kicking and screaming into this business. But if she had not recruited me in the first business we were in together, and in this one, I wouldn't know any of you people. And so I'm grateful from my heart, Lisa for all that you have done for all of us. And I, I know that we don't say it often enough, but you know, when you added how to the mix, it became even more special than, than it was. And, um, but these people on the screen, you know, I know most of them personally, and I love each and every one of you and you know who you are. And so, from, from, from the company standpoint, that's what I am thankful for. Next is, would be the products. Um, I truly believe that I would not be where I am today physically if it wasn't for the Zelise products. And most of you know my story, but it's um, the products are wonderful. Ice, I love. Susan was talking about ice being their best seller. I can certainly see why. So there's so many things that I'm thankful for a business opportunity, friends and family here, and Lisa, you and Hal. Angela, thank you so much. Um, and Angela, tell everyone how many years young you are. I was 85 this last month. And still setting goals for age 90. You inspire all of us, Angela. Thank you so much for being part of this. You, you were my first drug deal. We always laugh about that because we did drag her into this business. But as a result, uh, many of you guys are on Angela's team and uh, we just, it's been a privilege, Angela. So thank you so much for sharing that. Anybody else want to share? I do. I'm thankful for Lori and Jean. I've been going through a lot of really rough years and they keep telling me I can do this. 
and they're out there getting as much information and support as they can and they're not greedy about it they share it they keep passing it forward they keep doing what they can so they're the people i see the most but pretty much it means i'm grateful for the whole team so thank you all thank you mary and you're right they're awesome they are very very awesome <laughs> we love them Thank you, Mary. What wasn't sure about it the first day I met him, but second day, I <laughs> we're, we're, we're all good. <laughs> That's all. Thank I you. Was sure, the first time I met him, I was sure. So, mm. but that was many years ago. Wow. So. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We 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 we've loved them from day one. Them and you all. You can't help it. Money. You yeah, can't help it with right. them, though. You just can't. That's right. What you know, and they're so ordinary. It's, you can't help but love them that's right they'll, they'll make you laugh even when you don't want to so. <laughs> okay. thank you mary thank you mary thank you for sharing thank you well hal i'll tell you i'm grateful for for glow and uh you know what i've lost right at 25 pounds now and my blood sugars are dropping so i'm happy i've been on it about seven weeks going on eight weeks now, I think I hit a plateau because I'm, I'm kind of maintaining that 250 mark. But, you know, I mean, we got the new year coming in resolutions. And if I eat just a little bit better, a few less cookies, I think we'll be heading in the right direction. So I'm, I'm thankful for that. And again, our, our support team that we have, you know, I mean, you guys are awesome. We thank you for each and every one of you. And we just, uh, you know, pray for a, a beautiful Christmas for everyone in a safe new year. Thank you, Gene. You know, I think your story of your weight loss, um, you know, this is a guy that gets up around noon, goes to work and doesn't get home till late at night, works hard um, and on his feet um, all day and then come home and basically eats dinner when he gets home right. and then goes to bed and gets up and does it again. And that's not an easy lifestyle to um, live a healthy diet and a healthy sleep pattern, but your 25 pound weight loss. And yeah. I mean, then that's your product story. The two of you have grown so much personally, uh, your mindset, how you approach life, how you, how you approach people, how you um, are always, always, always on every call, very faithfully. And even more than that, you just are always signing up for personal growth, not only here, but outside of this, you know, in your spiritual lives and, and, uh, but you're an inspiration. So when you talk about um, less cookies, I, what I love about a person who's lost weight like this with the glow product, that's a significant amount. I mean, that's close to 10% yeah. uh, of, of where you started. Yeah. Um, yeah. At that point, it seems that you could continue that inspiration to others simply by making some lifestyle choices. And I right. do think that jumpstarting uh, a change for a better health at our age uh, can begin with a glow product. And then we have to, you know, then we get to make some choices more significant. So anyway, uh, thank you for sharing and, and uh, with, um, your gratitude and appreciate that. Thank you. Now, I do have to say that I think it's very unfair for one thing. So I'm going to go through my list very quickly. <laughs> I'm actually very uh, thankful for the patience of our leadership, Jean for me, and our team, because it's been a really crazy year. I'm very grateful that um, I'm still able to help bunnies. Um, every bunny that comes into my home, um, I we have too many again. Um, but I tell Joy, they're going to go on CBD, CBG, and she's like, she's okay. Happy. <laughs> so she knows that it is definitely helping with neurological issues and personality right now issues because we have some grumpy butts. Um, but also the personal growth has been amazing and better health uh, for yeah. me and also um, keeping me at a steady uh, level of um, because things could be really uh, Real gone off the deep end, but between all of you and you know this product, it's been amazing. So, thank you, Lily. Thank you. You're welcome. And those of you guys who are just listening in, I want you to really kind of think about 
what people are saying in terms of their product responses. Uh, Lorraine is amazing because she's the bunny master and they've seen that rabbits do extremely well uh, with CBD and CBG. So who do you know that has a rabbit or loves animals? Um, just take notes of what you're seeing and hearing because these are these are results that are, you know, months and years in the making. Um, so just be aware of what you're hearing because these results have real power. We've got some hands up. I think Kristen and Eric have theirs up and then maybe um, uh, and Susan, Gentry, Susan Everett. Susan and okay. Debbie. Yeah. Kristen? Yes, thank you, um, everybody, and happy holidays. I'd like to ditto what everybody else said. Of course, we've had the product experiences and um, also thank you for the, the leadership, um, Lisa and Hal and so many others on this team. Uh, but I did make a personal list and uh, it includes a creative, purposeful expansion and healing on so many levels in my life, um, emotionally, spiritually, physically, um, socially, and also uh, the camaraderie, the friendship, like starting with people like Lisa and Angela, um, so many people on this. I, I could go through so many names. I've stayed in your <clears throat> homes. I've shared meals with you. I've danced with you. Thank you so much for those friendships. Um, I can't name you all, but thank you. And uh, also the leadership, uh, Lisa and Hal, Angela, all of you, every call that we're on. There's always leadership on so many levels and also for Steven and all the others on the team. Um, the fun, 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 how much fun we have. Um, thank you for that. Uh, the support of the modalities and spiritual guys that have come into my life um, as I've been seeking and opening up. Um, so many wonderful influences have come in, uh, not just here on this platform, but others, um, so many different things that I get to, to participate in today that have helped me grow and heal um, myself. And I think one of the things that happened when I heard this call was about gratitude was like, it's kind of like the lids come off of me. You know, I, I'm at a place where I'm dreaming again. I'm imagining, I'm achieving things in different areas. And I get really excited that I can wake up and meet new people that were pioneering a leading industry uh, cutting edge technology is kind of passion. I love when we change the way we do things for the better. Um, and so I get very excited um, to be a part of this and not just to have the people that I've been able to, to know and grow with, but also to be introduced to the really the loveliness that's out there in the world, like Stacy and some other people that I've been um, impacted by and, and very fortunate to meet. And uh, thank you so much, everybody. Well said. Thank you, Kristen. I might as well jump in here too, since we had the platform. No, I'm very grateful to be involved with Elise. It's it, it's it's putting me in a position where I have to expand myself. Um, I'm very accustomed to as how I talk about following a recipe, and, and my life has been kind of the same recipe for about ten or fifteen years. And uh, in, in this opportunity uh, to get out of what I'm accustomed to, to get out of my comfort zone. And thank God we have a product that helps with anxiety <laughs> because uh, I get anxious when I have to do something new. And that was my first product experience was a decline in anxiety. And I've definitely noticed a decline, a further decline with the, the glow that there's actually kind of I wouldn't say mood enhancement, but I definitely feel happier to be involved uh, in my life. So, uh, and it's great to have a whole brand new set of people I would never have met on the street, right? That's another thing that this business does. It brings together people you, we would not normally mix with. And, uh, and that's exciting because I can isolate. I'm very good at just being in my own home. My, my, you know, the home-based business, is, unfortunately, keeps me at home, uh, and, and this push, puts me out there. So I appreciate Hal and Lisa and Angela and the, the rest of your friendships, and I, too, enjoy going to these conventions and, and, and meeting you guys in a different arena. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you very much. Beautiful thoughts. I think Susan, Susan. Everett. Um, we see some more hands up. We and see we'll you. get to you guys. Thank you. Susan? Susan, you're muted. Yes, I got it. I was trying to figure that out. 
not used to doing this for my phone. Well, I probably could have not raised my hand after I listened to what Kristen had to say, because so much of what I feel is pretty much similar to things she said. Uh, when Lisa and I met, I was working for a company at a job that I did not care for. And so I felt like that, you know, when you're doing that, you just are, you're imploding. <laughs> And Zalise has given me personally an opportunity to go back and revive myself. I feel like, you know, back to doing personal growth that I had walked away from and, and just really improving myself. And I, you know, I just uh, am happier as far as that's concerned. You know, it's the creative energy that she mentioned. I can relate to that because uh, that kind of had felt like it had died. So I appreciate it on a personal level, personal growth. I really appreciate you guys because uh, Lisa, I know you're a smart woman and you keep encouraging me. So you must see something there because you're not stupid, but I'm still looking for it. Uh, but but you, your encouragement that you give me all the time, I really appreciate it. And I appreciate the belief that you give me in myself uh, and the others around you. It's just awesome. And so uh, thank you for that. So the product, obviously, we all know great stories. And, you know, when somebody tells you, hey, thanks, that's really making a difference in my life. I want to buy it again, that you, you really, um, you know, there's nothing like that. Uh, that feeling. So, I mean, I'm, I'm sure that some of the other people, especially with a doctor in their name, uh, have felt similar things, but I hadn't before in my career. So to have people say, thank you, what you did for me has, has changed my life or has, that's, that means everything. So uh, thank you for that opportunity, Lisa. Well, Susan, I have to say not many people can take the abuse that I give every single week and, and still show up for it. Uh, I'm so, so grateful uh, that we crossed paths at that leadership conference. And uh, Susan's one of those, uh, she's actually, I, I personally sponsored Susan. And so she's building a team, but she has uh, remained accountable. And uh, Susan, how long have we been meeting one-on-one? -on -one? I, I don't want to tell everybody that because they'll know <laughs> how slow I am. So let's just kind of gloss over that. It's like every time you ask poor Angela how old she is, every time you ask me how long I've been out this, <laughs> let's just skip that part. <laughs> Hey, it's all happening at the right time. Not That's longer right. than Lisa. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Not longer than me, girl. We're, it's a privilege. So thank you for sharing, Susan. I think Mary Jo or Thelma, I think Thelma was next. Though. Thelma Champion, she's number 15 on the leaderboard. And Susan, you're number 23. I don't know if you heard us recognize you. So uh, Thelma Champion, let's hear it. Hey, Lisa and Hal, thank you. Um, okay, so I'll keep mine brief, but I wanted to say thank you for your leadership that I am very just grateful, over the top grateful for everything that y'all do every week. And um, obviously the company, I love Zelise, I love the products, I love what they've done for me and my family, especially my daughter. But I think most importantly that I wanna to express tonight is just my gratitude to Dr. Steven and Jenny Todd, because he is my mentor, he believes in me, they both do. And just for him, from all of his coaching, training, and never giving up on me. So I want to say thank you to them that I love them. And they're my family, as everyone else on the call is. And I'm just ecstatic that the new year is going to bring, bring great things. So thank you. Hey, Dr. Thanks, Thelma, Thelma Champion, we're not done with you yet. <laughs> thank you for sharing that. Uh, we agree, Steve and Jenny are, are just amazing. We're so, so grateful for them. But tell us, uh, why would a chiropractor uh, be interested in Zelise? Well, okay, for myself, it's, you know, chiropractic is all about bringing the body into balance and homeostasis. So everything about Zelise is about bringing the body into balance and homeostasis. So it, it resonates with the chiropractic philosophy. So to have a product that is natural and that isn't, doesn't have harmful side effects and it can help relieve pain, inflammation. I mean, all the things that, you know, the products do it just resonates with the chiropractic philosophy, which is bringing the body into homeostasis. Fantastic, well said. We're so, we're so fortunate that you've chosen to, to take this journey with us. So thank you for sharing. Thank you, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas thank to you. you too. Thank you. And Mary Jo? Thank Mary Jo. Mary Jo Perry. Hey, can you hear me okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay, I'm driving. I had to leave the house and get on the road before I could talk because <laughs> Because the thing that I wanted to say that I'm so grateful for, I couldn't say in front of my husband, I'll tell you why. Anyway, Merry Christmas, everybody. So um, 
What I'm, I'm really grateful for was Elise is that even when I have too many irons in the fire as I'm so terrible to do, um, the, I have a product that keeps selling itself. And um, I recently had a, a, a customer who has, they've used the, the UltraCell before, but, but they had COVID and they're, you know, like in their probably mid forties and they just married off um, one of their daughters and the mama, the mother of the bride has just been not been able to get her oomph back after COVID. And, um, and she came by the house and I gave her, it was, she bought a bag of glow. And after two days, she called me and she said, how long have you been taking this stuff? She said, I feel so good. I want to buy it for everybody that I love. And, oh, wow. and, so, and so she enrolled and she'll probably upgrade at some point, but she's already, you know, um, getting some for, you know, different people in her family. But, um, but so since it continues to kind of sell itself like that, I have money saved in the bank and I'm headed over to Lowe's to get my husband a really jam up Weber grill for Christmas. Oh, he, that's what you didn't want him to hear. <laughs> I didn't want him to hear. Okay. So, <laughs> that's anyway, awesome. Um, yeah. So I'm really excited about, we're going to hide it in the horse trailer until Christmas, <laughs> but um, anyway, it's, uh, it, it's quite a grill and um, I, I I actually got it, got it a little bit on sale because uh, it was the floor model, but man, it's nice. And I, awesome. I can't wait, can't wait to give it to him right out of my Zelise account and he'll never even feel it. There you go. He'll awesome, Mary Jo, that's yeah. great. Thank you for yeah, sharing. He's real 17 years old and he's not been wanting to get off his wallet and get another one. So anyway, wow. but that's it. Love y'all. Thank Mary. you, Mary, Thanks, Mary Jo. Jo. All right. Okay. All right. I think that, and I think Angie, was next. Angie Hawkins, are you next? Well, I guess I am. I just okay. want to say thank you to, of course, you and Hal, uh, Lisa, and uh, and just everyone because the presence and the influence, the positive energy, all of it has made a difference in my life. Um, I mean, just just the acquaintance. I mean, Angela at the convention, just different people that I met along the way has allowed me to improve as a person and to grow as a person, as an, an, an individual. Uh, Thelma at the convention, uh, just different ones that have touched my life, the different testimonies that people shared, all of it has changed me for the better. And they say to always have people that are, are, are better off than you are to allow you to grow as a person. And I feel like all of you all are doing that for me and I appreciate it. I appreciate the product. I appreciate the ethics that Stephen has in this company. I, I love the pay it forward mission, everything that it stands for. It's an easy sell to talk to people about the company and or the product and or the people of the company. And you don't get that all of it across, you know, you, everything is, is, is a win. And I love that. And I'm grateful for it. I'm, I'm so thankful God put it in my life. And I just wanted to say thank you. Thank and Mary, thank you, Angie. Well said, girl. We're grateful to get to work with you too. I think Christina, I think Christina Durham. Uh, Christina, are you there? I'm here. I got to figure out how to put a picture on here, if nothing else. <laughs> <laughs> I think um, I, when I started um, back into the lease, because I say back in because I tested the waters three years ago and I never would have jumped back in as fast as I did this round. Um, if it wouldn't have popped back across my Facebook feed, I'm, I'm not even sure where that came from. Um, and I'm going to get teary eyed when I talk about it, but, um, at that point in time, I was dealing with just a lot of pain in, in my neck and my shoulder and, um, started physical therapy like a week before that. And being able to take these products, um, has really helped with a lot of that pain. Like it has for a lot of people, um, had an MRI and I'm still going to have to have surgery for a rotator cuff, which, you know, that's just half the battle. But for me, um, seeing my family's health, um, with my dad and, um, I even stopped by tonight and my stepmom, she's had vision issues for a long time. And, she was really afraid to start taking the glow because she was afraid it would um, disrupt her vision. And she started the CBG this week and she said the glow made her vision better. 
because she only has one eye. <laughs> but yeah. the CBG has actually even more increased her vision and, and had the clarity that's in that eye. So, you know, just what it's done for my family is just night and day difference in the way they feel as well. But um, Angela's really kind of pushed on me to figure out my why um, this last month. So I'm working on that and I should have it I'm ready for when you get into town next week. Um, but helping people has always been a passion for me. Just that knowledge um, of health and how things affect the body and, and hearing other people's stories and to be able to help them um, become healthier and better, um, regardless of what that is for them. Just the stories that come in are insane to me. And to know that um, I can be a driving force in helping change their lives. I was able to make my car payment this week um, out of my my Glow account or out of my Zelis account and still have money in there. And I've got, you know, and that's paying for shows this year and that's already paid for some shows for next year. So just that financial freedom that I'm starting to really see and I'm not even really that far up into things yet. So I can only imagine what the future is gonna hold, um, but I'm very much blessed by the team that God's put in, in my way. Um, you guys are amazing and thank you for your patience and, and the questions. I, I have a thirst for things. So I just tend to sometimes ask instead of going out and searching it all out, just because if I go and search it out myself, I'll get lost in it. And it's kind of that rabbit hole. Um, but then I'm also thankful for Zelise, for them taking the time to go and look into the science of the way all of this works and the way it all fits together and what it does for us individually, because that's, you know, thumbprints are the way our, our bodies are built. So I'm just really, really um, thankful for, for all that and the teaching that they do um, for us to be able to go out and to give the knowledge to the world that we do. So I thank you guys. And I thank all of you for, for being here. And I wish you guys a Merry Christmas. Well, it sounds to me like you're far up in there pretty good. Girl. <laughs> I'll tell you what, and you know, new people like you um, who, have, who really hit the ground running and, and, um, to make this work for you, for your family, because you have a lot going on with your family as well and have had for some time. Um, but to see your dad and his wife, uh, you know, kind of follow you in a little bit yeah. uh, is inspiring. And now to hear these great stories, because we've heard that your story this week uh, about your dad in particular, it's really neat to hear about her as well. So anyway, uh, new people like you guys, and I call you new, I mean, new compared to us, right? Right. <laughs> uh, are so encouraging um, when you kind of take this on in the midst of your life. Because like Lisa said for a long time, this is a business that you can work in the gaps of life. If you're, if you're focused and have a why, um, you really can fit this in and, and change people's lives, but also build a residual income, um, which is very different than people's, you know, trading time for money kind of job so anyway uh, we have got some more people here but thank you Christine, thank you for Christina your... and, thank and you guys. just you know you're you're uh hitting the ground running and hitting these vendor shows dragging Angela uh, <laughs> along with you I mean you have inspired all of us just to get off our rear and go out and and work this so thank you for the example I gotta take up for Angela it sounds like she's being dragged everywhere but actually <laughs> She's but she not. didn't push so hard, she wouldn't be dragged behind. Let's get it know, that way. I know. So anyway. <laughs> I want to uh, add something. Thanks. She is, she has stepped out on faith. So mm -hmm. she has a lot of faith in herself and in her God to help her through this. And because um, this is all she does. Right. This, this is her job. She has two sons and, and responsible for everything herself. So yeah. kudos to her for all of that. Amazing. Thank you. All Thank right. you well, guys. We have two more hands Thank raised you. that I can see. So Deborah Ray. Hi guys. Hey. I girl. just want to say that I am so grateful for Lisa stepping out before Hal was even involved in it. She would come all the way from Indiana to Nashville um, to help us uh, build teams and to share the science behind it. Um, at the time, I had gone through, uh, I guess, two years. I. I've been in it three years, August of this past year, um, but two years prior to that, I was diagnosed with cancer and was on a hormone blocker and it disrupted my sleep and the Ultracell at the time was the only product we had really. And within a month I was sleeping 
so much better, more restorative sleep. Um, but I, I love the products. I believe in the products. I love the opportunity to share with others. And as everybody said, it's such a great opportunity to hear the stories back from people you shared with and they thank you. And what other job can you say that you can get that? And I just appreciate Lisa and Hal now. They've come out numerous times to Nashville and uh, helped with Stephen coming. And I appreciate everyone on this call on Sunday nights because everybody has strengths and, and everybody's willing to share their strengths and ideas. And it keeps me going because I don't have a direct upline here, um, but everybody here is willing to share and help. And I love that. And thank you. We sure love you, Deb. And uh, just appreciate the consistency that you have built this with. You've just been steady and it's showing. So we're grateful. I'm just stubborn. <laughs> hey, there you go. It's a strong will. We know the, how important that is. Well, and Thanks. I love helping people. So it comes across. It, comes, it absolutely yeah. does. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And Dr. Lisa Hall is next. So um, I, I don't want to just repeat everything everybody else has said. I agree with everything everybody else has said, but um, I, I want to tell you how thankful I am for Stephen Thompson and his willingness to innovate, research, develop this product. And, you know, the increased absorption with our ultracell. I mean, when I met this product in 2018, it was doubtful I was going to see 2019. Western medicine was out of options for me. And so I feel 100%. I know I don't have to feel. I know that this product saved my life. And um, so I just am very thankful for Stephen Thompson. And I mean, he could be pocketing a lot more money, but he is researching, developing, innovating, and getting us more products that work better and help more people every single day. So I'm very thankful for that. And I just um, want to say one thing. When you, everybody has fear to talk to people. It doesn't matter who they are. But when you have that fear to talk to somebody about it or you're not sure, um, overcome that, be courageous and talk to people because you never know that you might, might possibly be saving that person's life. Um, even if it's just taking them out of pain or you know, people do crazy things for a lot worse things than, or you know, a lot minor, more minor things than pain. So just be courageous and talk to people because we meet people for a reason and a destiny. And, um, you know, Lisa and I met, gosh, I think it's been close to 20 years ago now. I don't know, <laughs> whatever it is, 12, 13, whatever it is. But, you know, we meet people for a reason. And um, so, you know, if that helps you to overcome that fear of talking to people, because sometimes, you know, we worry about being ridiculed or whatever. But you know what? I don't care. I don't care what anybody thinks of me. I'm still here. I get to see my grandbabies have another Christmas, you know, I mean. You guys just overcome your fear and be courageous because the Lord put people in your in your life. You know, it's destiny. There's a reason. That's well, awesome. Lisa, thank you so much for sharing. And, you know, it means a lot, not just your story, but just your medical validation as, a, as an MD um, that, you know, really understands the best of Western and and, you know, Eastern medicine. You've, you've used both. Not only in your practice, but for your own life. For your own life. Yeah. Yeah. So it's really... Uh, an amazing and thing. And Lisa, I so. also want to thank you for being an amazing resource, um, not just, just sharing your story and all the help that you've done with our team, even people that don't directly benefit you, but also with you and Rebecca and uh, training on social media. You guys are just amazing team players. I, I, I really, I can't thank you enough. I'm just so grateful that we're doing this journey together. And I, I know you're working your butt off. You're number four on the leaderboard. And uh, that's when you're not number one. I mean, like a lot of months you've just, you, you say number one, you in mercy. And so we just appreciate, and we, we know how hard you're working right now. Just want you to know that. All right. Uh, anyone I'm else? Coming uh, for you, so watch out. Hey okay. girl, Good. come on, Good bring point. it, baby, bring it. Pass me up, pass me up. <laughs> I think that um, two things, uh, Julia Baker, I don't know if she's still on. I just read in the chat that she wanted to share something. Julia, are you still there? She might have had to jump. And then also Ted, uh, thank you. Was that Julia? No. Okay. Uh, Ted, we, we just wanted to just- Go ahead. Oh, there's Julia. No, we'll go ahead with what you're saying about Ted. Okay, so I'll finish my thought on Ted and then we'll come back to Julia. But 
Ted just lost his father. And Ted, I just want to thank you for being on this call and being part of this team. And um, just, it was such a blessing to get to meet your dad when we were in Tampa. And uh, I just, I know what it feels like to, ha to lose your parents. So we, we just, we're lifting you up and just want you to know that uh, condolences to you and your family. You, you've done an amazing job as a son. So thank you for being on this team and, and being part of Zalise and carrying on this mission. Um, and I see Julia Baker. So I'm gonna just turn it over to Julia. She's beautiful, look at her. Julia, you're muted. There you go. You're uh, one more time, Julia. You're still muted. You look like you sound good, but there it is. Oh, Julia, you're, Julia, you're gonna have you're to real garbled. Speak more directly or something into your. I had my little. There you go. Okay. There you go. So. Anybody who's lost somebody around, I lost a cousin around this time of year. I mean, my heart goes out to you. Um, I wanted to say that, but I'm, I'm telling you, I can't even begin to say how thankful I am for this business, for Lisa, for everybody. Um, Mary Zaliak, she is my supplier when things don't come as quick as they should. I mean, everybody is just amazing. Um, I have done so much personal growth in the last four months that other companies I've been with and I've been in business for myself, you know, you got like maybe a convention that had a pump, rah, rah, let's do it kind of thing, but nothing, nothing like this company is trying to help us to evolve. And um, the fact that I've had you know, cancer and bone cancer now. And uh, I feel great. People are seeing it. They're asking. I have people coming up to me now and wanting to know the information. And I, I'm just so thankful that Lisa hung in and I just keep, you know, hanging in there and, and staying steadfast because that's what it takes. And I keep hearing that. And that's my belief is I may not be the sprinter off the block, but I am a distance person. And this is for for the distance that it takes to get where I want to um, with my business too. But anyway, um, everybody, I hope you have such a blessed Christmas and I, I am overflowing with all the things that um, the Zlis has done for me physically, the, the um, training emotionally, mentally, and the friendships, you know, just have been stellar. Thank you. Thank you, Thanks, Julia. Julia. You add so much to our team, girl. Your story is inspirational and I, I share it uh, several times a week. So thank you for being so transparent. We sure love you, girl. Love you too. All right. Anybody We're else want to share? You guys share it out. Oh my We're Coming goodness. up to the top of the hour it has flown by. So, all right. Anybody last share before we uh, conclude? Before we have Alan and Mercy do their thing. <laughs> Well, you guys, uh, this does feel like a, very much like a family and uh, we're so excited. We're, we're gonna be in Evansville um, next Tuesday. Thanks to Mary Ellen Ziliak for, for hosting that. Um, Mary Ellen, she did put in the chat that she's so grateful uh, that she uh, can uh, actually have a wellness cabinet that uh, instead of her, as she said her, her wellness cabinet has replaced her medicine cabinet, which is awesome. And um, I think we got another, is anyone else not okay? Uh, Mary asked about losing weight with glow. Um, and, you know, that's, um, let me just address that since she put that in the chat. Weight is not linear weight loss. Um, unfortunately, weight gain is because it goes up one way, <laughs> but weight loss when you're actually losing weight is not linear. And kind of what we know about glow is just that it's a very individualized product. Um, what I believe is the strongest way to take glow is actually directly on your tongue. And the instructions are that you can mix it. You can mix it with water. You can mix it with a drink. I personally feel it more and I'm less hungry when I take it directly on my tongue. So if you're not doing that, I, I highly recommend that. The other thing is, is that if you don't feel like you're getting the results that you should, you guys text me, call me, let me work with, with you on it because I've spent my entire life in health and fitness and um, we thought initially that, you know, just you just take glow and you lose weight. Well, That's kind of what happened in the study. But the study 
uh, the, the subjects guys were 250 to 350 pounds. So they were large, healthy people. Uh, when you're large, healthy people, because they were not on medication. That's true. Uh, yeah, they so they were, they were considered healthy. I mean, if you, you know, healthy, large people, that's exactly what they were. So, um, you know, we've seen people that are a higher weight do lose, lose weight faster, easier people who are of normal weight, or maybe have a few pounds to lose. It's, it's going to take more potentially and inches are going to be very different than weight. So make sure you measure your waist circumference. You can measure your arms, your, your, your bust, your hips, because we're seeing a different picture with inches with regard uh, to this glow product. So we just do that on an individual. The other basis. thing is that um, I think probably the longest anybody would have been on this product would probably be eight weeks, eight weeks max. Yeah. Most people are, are probably at six or seven weeks for most people that got it early. And this was a, a 12 week study. And um, so anyway, but the question was, is anyone else not um, seeing the seeing weight loss? Um, and I don't think we want to open up this call for that. That's right. not what this call is about, but do reach out to Lisa. Yeah, just um, let me let me work with you guys just because we we've done that on an individual basis and uh, there's... Now I will say I lost quite a bit of weight um, with changing uh, with taking some with with glow but um, I say quite burn. a bit it wasn't a lot but with burn combo um, but I'm going to be real frank with you uh, when Thanksgiving came around and my wife if y'all have heard she bakes all the time and we've had parties to go to. Our refrigerator and our and our like our counters are literally full of food, and and candy and all kind of stuff that is not, not conducive to any weight loss or maintaining a weight that you've lost. So I don't know if there's anybody else that's experienced anything like that, but I'm not blaming her. I'm just stating a fact. If you expect to lose weight, you don't just pour this stick in your mouth and do, you know, go eat all the Christmas candy like me, you know, I was like, I can't do that. I can't eat all the cookies. Um, and, 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 and so I mean, anyway, point is that I think Zelise really set themselves up for a big challenge of bringing Zelise, this product on during the stinking holidays. And yet at the same time, I think many of us thought, oh, good, this will be the first Christmas I don't gain 10 pounds because you know, I can just take this glow stick and, and lose 10 pounds instead of gain 10 pounds. So uh, again, I do believe that <laughs> the products are definitely helping people cut back on their cravings, lose weight. It's adjust adjusting. It is going to take time. But I've said from the beginning, I don't believe in a pill or a stick or a drop that, that you don't just, you know, like, change some lifestyle, change right, some right. choices, change your mindset, change, actually do whatever. You got to do more than just take the drop. Right. And uh, really, unless you're over 250 pounds, which is what the study group was in. And, and they literally took one or two sticks of glow a day. And, but that's the age that I, that's the weight that, that actually had success. So uh, anyway, say, um, yes, Julia. I was going to say, here's the bottom line is the study was done with them not changing any lifestyle. They weren't eating Thanksgiving meals. They weren't right. eating Christmas dinners. Well, that I mean, you know, right now we're in the season that they were not in. Now they may have gone out and eaten whatever, but this is the hardest season. And so if people have kind of leveled out, it, it would keep on it because we're going to pull out of this season where there's extra food and fatty things and all that yeah, definitely and the other the other thing is and that's a great point but you know the instructions were they weren't instructed to do things differently but they weren't discouraged from if they want to eat less food because of this you know that, right. that they had to keep their portion size up you know like whatever so anyway so. well listen guys it we're we're uh, definitely over time and so i just want to so thanks to everybody um, for being on this call every single week. Thank you to uh, the new ambassadors who have been on this call and like, you know, wide eyed and, and uh, just kind of initiated to the elevation call. And we, we decided that we're going to go ahead and meet next Sunday as well, the 26th. Uh, we're going to stick with our schedule. We really need to start thinking uh, 2022. 
We're very excited about getting to see a lot of you guys over the next couple of weeks. Uh, you'll never know exactly what you do uh, for us, for our lives, um, the inspiration that you provide, um, you guys, every single one of you. We, we love y'all. Thank you so much for all the chat that you uh, registered. I, I see uh, Darcy uh, said Merry Christmas to everyone. And um, Karen Hale, thank you very much. Look forward to seeing you guys and Jeanette Crawford and Ted. So uh, we're going to go ahead and, and stop the recording. If you guys have any uh, questions, comments, we're here for another minute and then we'll, we'll break.